Today is Juneteenth. It commemorates the emancipation of enslaved black Americans. It's one of the most important events in American history, and President Biden declared it a federal holiday in 2021. Jay Jarvis explains a timeline of the holiday's history from the mid-1800s to present day. On January 1, 1863, President Abraham Lincoln issued the Emancipation Proclamation, freeing all enslaved people in Confederate states. But it would take another two plus years for word to reach those furthest south, like in Tallahassee on May 20th, which is Florida's Emancipation Day, and then finally in Texas on June 19th, 1865. And so in Juneteenth, um, not only does it celebrate that fight for freedom, but it also speaks to the fact that it wasn't actually just a specific date. Um, it was throughout June that the fight for ending slavery was going on. Edward Stinson is the museum educator at the Spady Cultural Heritage Museum in Delray Beach. So talk to me about how throughout the years Juneteenth became more well known and how we got to where we are now. Juneteenth did get celebrated directly after the Civil War for even a couple decades after that, but we're seeing the rise of Jim Crow. We're seeing vagrancy laws and black codes outright stop people from celebrating. Stinson says it wasn't until after the civil rights movement that Juneteenth celebrations started making a comeback, with Texas being the first state to recognize the date by law in 1980. Several others followed by the early 2000s. And finally, in 2021, President Joe Biden signed legislation making Juneteenth a federal holiday. What is the significance of Juneteenth and why is it important that we celebrate it? We have to celebrate it to remember that the act of fighting injustice and the act of gaining justice is not something that is just achieved and then we don't need to work on it anymore. It occurred, but we have to acknowledge that it didn't even actually fully end slavery. This was one of the first major steps towards ending um, the institution, but it is one step on the continuous battle of fighting for rights, fighting for the priorities of freedom, life, liberty, pursuit of happiness, democracy, and equality. In Delray Beach, Jay Jarvis, WPBF 25 News.